This is called an emergency meeting for Thursday in the Nigerian capital Abuja to decide on the next step. ECOWAS had warned that it would use military force if the coup plotters in Niger failed to reverse their action, and so far they haven't done so. In fact, the military junta is consolidating its hold on power. It's now closed the country's airspace, warning that any attempt to fly over Niger would be met with, quote, immediate response. As a result of the airspace closure, Air France has now suspended flights to and from Mali and Burkina Faso. Germany has also put on hold plans to withdraw its troops from neighboring Mali since it cannot fly uh, them over Niger. The Chinese embassy in Niger has also issued advisory to its nationals to leave the country for a third country or return home until the dust over the coup finally settles. France has also taken a similar step, warning its citizens against all travel to Niger and asking those still there to exercise caution and be vigilant. Meanwhile, Germany has now joined Italy in calling for a diplomatic solution to the political standoff in Niger as the ECOWAS deadline expires. In Niger itself, tensions are high as many are concerned as to what would happen next. Everyone is waiting to see what the outcome of Thursday's meeting by the leaders of uh, the ECOWAS region will be. For now, it's not looking like we're going to see any military action on Niger just yet. But we may see a ramping up of sanctions while the bloc intensifies diplomatic efforts. DG Badimasi, CGTN, Lagos, Nigeria.